Hello everybody in YouTube land. I am doing a couple of nice bone-in New York strip steaks. So I already got them seasoned and they've been sitting out for a little bit. So I'm just going to pop them on my little cast iron grill. Uh, and uh, go from there. I would have cooked these outside. That's it. But uh, it's, it's raining and can't use my grill, but uh, I'm going to definitely use my cast iron skillet, the grill skillet, and it's very good. Love it. And honestly, uh, you know, with steaks, it only takes a couple of minutes, you know, you, uh, you know, you a couple seconds on one side, probably like maybe a minute to a minute and a half, like what you like. And then you just kind of flip them and go from there. Now I already heated up my cast iron skillet because, you know, I just wanted to cure it a little bit to a little bit of some salt on the bottom. Some uh, oil, some nice grapeseed oil. I like grapeseed oil. It, with, with your cast iron, you know, you can use olive oil or vegetable oil. It doesn't really matter. But, you know, it's a little grapeseed oil, and sometimes, you know, that kosher saw just keeps it nice and clean and cures it. So, I'm just going to kind of grill these bad boys up a little bit. I got some broccoli in here, so we'll go over here and look at the steaks cooking. Now we got some broccoli cooking. I mean, it's just broccoli. I'm kind of just steaming it. So... We'll just go over there real quick and Ooh, nice. Just some broccoli. Not long. Just having a little bit of broccoli. And then we'll just go back to our steaks. And I think I'm just gonna you know have a couple of uh I don't know, maybe some sweet potatoes. Let me pop in for me because my wife's not, I don't think she's doing that right now, but I'm just going to pop a sweet potato in the microwave, and that would be nice. Let's go with the potato. Start with that. Thank goodness for like presets on microwave now, so you don't have to worry about that stuff. I'm just going to grab my little fork here and get my steak. Try about the time. Oh yeah. Starting to get some nice grill marks on it. Maybe just touch up the heat just a touch more for it. But you know, I'm gonna flip these just a couple more times. Oh, that one got a couple good marks too. That came out pretty nice. So let me grab just a little plate and put my fork on. And I'm gonna just put one right there, but for some reason. So we're just, you know, what's great about New York strips? Everything. Everything is great with you, you know, have a steak. You turn on the light. Ooh, there we go. That might help with the lighting a little bit. Yeah, I would have cooked them outside on the grill if I could, but at that point, you know, it is what it is. Um, these cook, I'm going to make myself a potato, a sweet potato, which is good for you. And, no. At that point, there's nothing wrong with having delicious steaks. So what's your favorite food? Leave it in the comments. You know, I enjoy meat. I'm a meat eater. So at that point, it's kind of hard for me to like go to plant-based stuff. Even though I've, I've enjoyed some really awesome mochi tofu and uh, some fried tofu and some impossible waffles and veggie burgers. It's not like I, and you know, 
I won't eat a, a not meat dish, but you know, there's just something about eating a steak off the bone. It's kind of primeval, a little bit, you know, nice. Turn that. Okay. I'm gonna turn this guy. that you can't really control the fire. You know, you can't control the heat. You might think you know where the heat's at, but it's not really where it's at. Um, but at this point, we'll get some nice little grill marks on this, like we do. And then the steaks are, will be pretty much ready to eat. My potato's almost done. It's been just a couple minutes on the potato, which is nice. Uh, so, and then everything will be done for dinner. I'm going to turn up the heat a little bit on the broccoli. Mm, smells good. Put a little salt on that broccoli. You know, it's not bad to eat healthy. So, always good. Alright, I'm going to flip that steak. This is where it's going to get most of it's cooked up on this side. Turn it up a little bit higher. It's pretty much almost done. So I just want to cook it fairly through. Let that kind of sit for a little bit, maybe put a little bit through. Might put another minute on it. Then uh, at that point, I'm gonna get a couple steaks. Then I'll take a couple pictures of the finished product. Oh, just uh, the sizzling of the pan is just nice. Alright, at that point it's getting very hot. I'm going to turn that off. I'm going to flip it one more time. Just one more time. There we go. Woo. I just want to make sure. You know, it's nice. It's pretty much at a medium rare, what I think. So. But at that point, beautiful steaks. They look really nicely done. Give it one more look. All right, I'm just going to take a nice little bite of my steak, and I will sign off. Ooh. I need to get a new kitchen table, I tell you. Oh, look at that. Perfectly cooked. I, that's just medium rare. Delicious. Mm. Real good stuff. everybody please like subscribe and hit that notification